The 2 1 win against Barcelona has to be the highlight of last episode. It was really good that we were able to get that win. And it got us all the way back up to fourth position, as you guys can see there. Barcelona is still first. And I actually don't know what, how many points they're on right now. I think they're on 35. So they're just five away from us. Right now, we have Real Madrid to play against. And if we win this match, we're going to be just one point behind them. And that's good enough for me. Hopefully, at Let's Go Madrid loses their match. That will actually work out so well for me. So Risi is already on an 83 and I'm going to be bringing him Fonseca, German and Helvig here are already on an 86. They're the high rated. Oh, and Locatelli are all on 86. And the team's average rating is actually over 80 right now. And I'm actually really happy about that. Kudus, Kudus has also entered the 80, 80 overall zone. And I think I'm pretty much good with this lineup for the match against Real Madrid is going to be really tough but I feel like we should be able to pull through. Alright so there you have it Fonseca with 13 goals in the league right now. We are almost at the halfway stage and he has 13 goals. He has had a really good start to the season and I'm really proud of him to be honest. But I'm going to be jumping straight into the match right now. Let's hope that we can repeat what we did against Barcelona. Real Madrid is going to be slightly tougher side to be honest in my opinion and we get the ball right off the bat and what the hell happened there? Alright, so we have a good chance here for Stewart to get a goal, but I'm going to give it to German and that's a really good start to the match. And it was really good play from Risi and Fonseca up there to be able to get the ball. And we're just able to get it out to German who found Stewart in the perfect position. And that is a really good opening goal for our team. Alright, we have a little bit of work on our hands here. Let's just... Okay, we weren't able to get this loose there, but we do get our free kick. The team actually has a lot of focus. It's like they are so freaking focused right now. And that was a good, good chance for for Germa to get a second goal. And oh, that was that was a nice pass, but it just didn't come off. All right, so that is pretty fucking dangerous. And I just made a really big mistake at the back there. I actually got confused with what I wanted to do. And Benzema was never going to miss from there. Good goal from Real Madrid though. But I really feel like we could have um, avoided this. I just made a really big freaking mistake at the back and what well, it cost us. Alright, we have Benzema. But Donovan is fast enough to catch up with him. And that was a good interception from Donovan. Did really well in defense there. I don't freaking get it. Oh my days. Oh my days. That actually just happened. That actually just happened. Now we almost just scored ourselves. What the hell? Okay, but we're able to survive that. Let's see if we can get something out of this corner. All right, it's Fonseca at the far end, but he doesn't. Oh, okay. Okay, it's German that ends up with the ball here, but let's see if we can get Fonseca to go. And that is a brilliant pass from German. And all that's left now is for us to get the finish, and we just weren't able to. Took too much freaking time with Fonseca there, and we, should, we could have just blasted it from the start. I have no idea what the hell I was thinking. And <coughs> sorry about that. And now it's half time. We could have gone 3 0 up possibly in this first half. There's many things that we did wrong, both in defense and in attack. And that last chance for, for Fonseca there was really good. German did really well to set him up, and uh, he just wasn't able to capitalize on it. My fault though. All right, so that was good. That was a really good chance and we have some of the of opportunity and we just weren't able to do anything and the rebound came but Calimer wasn't able to jump high enough to get that header but we have a corner and I mean let's see if I can do something interesting here I mean Fonseca is double footed so let's try and go for goal but that didn't work out to be in my head okay so we have a chance and let's see if we can get a goal here and why the hell would you head that bro why the hell would you head that i really needed you to use your fucking leg at that point in time okay that was good from helvig and donovan to be able to get the ball all finishes okay so that is actually really good defending the team is actually doing so freaking well right now and I really don't even know who I want to take off, but I think I'm just going to bring in Lozano for... No, I'm just I'm going to bring Helvig for Flores. Sorry, Flores in for Helvig, and then I'll bring... Nobody really, it's not what I'm really interested in bringing to the team right now. I think I'm just going to stick with that for now, and let's see if we can at least get a goal in the second half. There's a corner for them, which means we have a chance for a counter-attack. Let's hope that we can get this out, and we do. Let's see if we'll be able to capitalize on this. And yes, Fonseca is free. Free on goal. 
and please don't lose this thank you no way you're missing that no fucking way hell you're missing that and that was an absolutely beautiful goal i think we'll look at that that did the the pass to fonseca and man was not based for, from there especially with the power shot i made sure i timed that to freaking perfection before i shot it and or that i made sure i aimed that to freaking perfection before i shot it and that is a really good goal from our guys right there so one against real madrid that is something that i can get used to to be honest especially on ultimate difficulty um okay and there we are fucking up once again let's just try and defend this as best as we can not like that though okay that was that was pretty good let's just run away with the ball german is free as well and please score it oh my god how do you freaking flop that i mean i could have possibly passed to kallenberg there but damn all right stewart is basically dying right now so i'm going to bring in lozano for him and then batch for locatelli and i think i'll bring in ziet for no let, let's let's put in more speed i need speed right now so i'm going to bring in Madike for resave there my priority right now is defending this and oh my days what happened there what the hell just happened there that was the most unbelievable shit that happened just now i, I, I can't believe i can't believe we actually left that enter the code. i mean we defended it properly but for some reason I, I don't even know what happened i mean the keeper saved it and then flores just completely talks for andre of just completely I, I don't even know what happened but and, and the ball just magically falls to benzema's feet that is that is fucking great, but you know, it's something we can really do about that. Okay, good interception from Lozano, and Fonseca is kind of free here. And we see Madike, and we just weren't able to hold that ball. But let's try and press, and we should be able to get this header for sure. And we do not. The ball is Benzema, we're dealing with what the hell is going on. Please do not, do not freaking do shit like that. Do not freaking do shit like that. Oh my god, I can't believe this is happening. Yet again, how fucking big this shit has happened! Wow. I mean, I tried my best there, but I just don't fucking know what the hell happened. Okay. It was, it was, it was, it was really, it was a really good skill from Benzema to be able to get that off and into the back of the net. That was, that was brilliant. I really can't complain about the finish, but I can complain about the defense. I mean, the defense was just not doing what I wanted them to do there. And well, this is exactly how the last match ended. And hopefully, that's the offside. That's fucking offside, and that's the end of the fucking match. Nothing we can do about it anymore. We are we are gone, and we passed, and that's basically the end of the match. No, even I'm not, I'm not even going to bother doing anything anymore. And that's the end. And. Uh, it was a good match we did really well to be able to go ahead twice and just like just like the first match we played for them in, in last season it ended up 3-2 they came back from behind and this, this one was even more frustrating because our team absolutely deserved this win and uh, well good match for the guys there next up we have Ajax the team is not really all that fit but I'm going to be bringing Lozano in for Zaracho and Flores is going to come in for Donovan and that should be good um I'm going to leave Ziet on for this match and I think I think I'm good with this lineup. I think this should be the second to the last match in the group stage of the Champions League. We are definitely going through to the to the to the um, round of season if we do win this match. First highlight is a penalty for these guys and that is that sucks to be honest. But let's see what we can do. And they do they make it it's a panenka and I have oh my days, oh my god, if they scored that. I'm going to be so freaking pissed because that was absolute bullshit. And I see Fonseca, and it's a good, it's a, it was supposed to be a well worked cross, but that didn't happen. But I see a really good chance here, but the, the shot was too weak. We have a free kick for us. Hallenberg is on it, and I see Donovan is not here, so that that kind of sucks. But Fonseca is the next best header. So let's just get this to him at the back and nothing comes of that but we still have the ball so that that is something and that was that was freaking weak next up we have a, a free kick in the 49th minute we have another chance to whip this into the box and i think i want to put kallenberg on this because he's just the better free kick taker and um i don't know who i'm playing this to exactly but let's just try and get this in so anybody can get ahead on this and that was beautiful that was a beautiful 
well worked free kick and I think this is Helvig's first goal for the club. We absolutely have to hold the lead that we built right now and I think that should be good enough. And that's the end of the match. It's just one opportunity that we're able to take and the most unlikely of scorers um, Helvig is the one that is able to get us the win in this match. So we are fifth on the league table. I actually didn't know that we were already in December but I think we finished the Champions League at second and that's good. So I mean it's going to be a tougher tougher um, round of 16 but I think we should be able to pull through if we at least get lucky enough to get a good matchup. Next up we have Hitafi and I'm going all out because we absolutely need to start climbing this table. We are fifth and Valencia is ahead of us. I do not want that. So let's just hope that we have minimal draws. We do we, we do get the win. We say get a brace. That's good for him. We have Espanyol up next. We're away from home and the only change I'm making in this lineup is Batch coming in for Locatelli and I'm going to be playing the attack and defensive highlights because I need to Make sure that we do not draw this match or lose it because of the same. And I really do not trust the fact that the simulations can fuck me up at any point in time. So I'm going to be taking matters into my own hands here. I'm going to try my best to defend and I'm going to try my best to score as much as possible in this match. Hopefully we get the we get a lot of attacking scenarios. And this is our first in the ninth minute, so that's pretty early. Um I hate this one where we have to work everything by ourselves. But uh let's see what we have here. That was that was brilliant. This time that's Oh my god, oh my god, why why the hell would you do that? Why the hell would you do that? That was a really brilliant pass from German. And Bro just completely fucked it up. Good defending from Stewart there. And we have another free kick. We have a free kick rather in the 35th minute. And I can't believe German didn't just blast that into the net. He freaking headed the ball. Most at the most stupid of times to be honest. And okay, we have a chance here and Good, and we should get the goal. That's the first goal was scoring open play with James. That's good for him to, to get the goal, and that's our first goal of the match. I'm kind of scanning what we need to do here. We should be able to get this goal. Um, German looks like the free one, and Fonseca might just be able to get there, but he's not. So I'm just get to take this with German myself, and that is 2 0 up. And we are absolutely demolishing this club. Donovan is nowhere to be found. Where the hell are you? Have you already been subbed out? Yep, probably. And James is next in. Make James next in line, and we do get that. But we are still with the ball, and I have no idea what the hell I want to do right now. And that is a good, good chance from Lise. But we have a counter attack here. I have no idea why. Oh, it's a, it's a solo run for, for them. And yeah, that's that's crazy. Stewart should be fast enough to hold this, hold him off, and damn. I mean, I hesitated there, and that's what I get. But we should be able to get this ball out, and yes, we do. Let's see if we can repeat what we did last last match against that team against Ajax, and hopefully, hopefully, we actually can get this to James or Fonseca. And we do get to Fonseca, and the defenders were just able to get the better of that. And that's the end of the match. We win it 2 0. German and James get the goals here. I think the team's actually doing a lot better in highlights and in full matches. German did, had five attempts in this match. That is crazy. Next up, we're home against Rio via Dolid, and I'm going to be saving the match. I made a couple changes to the lineup. I brought Kudus in for Kallenberg, Lozano in for Zaracho, and Rise is playing in place of Ziyech in this match. And let's hope we get the win. Hopefully, we do. And 4 0, that was. Crazy. Fonseca meets a penalty and that was a chance for a hat-trick for him. German also scores and Locatelli gets the last goal for the team. We are in January which means the transfer window is open and there's an offer for Zaracho for 81.8 million. Obviously I'm not selling him. I already said that I'm not selling any of my players in this season. So I think I'm just going to reject all of them off camera from, from now on. So we're back up in fourth position. Real Madrid is quite a ways away from us and they are on the same points with Atletico Madrid. Our top four spot is pretty much solid this time around. And I'm really content with what we have right now because I mean, we're, we're playing ultimate and we're able to stay this high up the table. That is good to see. The match against Sevilla has proven to be a pain in the ass time and time again. So I am definitely going all out with this. I'm playing both attacking and defensive highlights. Let's not get surprised like what we did, like what happened last season in the Copa de España where they magically went two goals up in the at extra time which was the most annoying fucking thing that's ever happened but now we're a way better team and to be honest these guys have nothing on us and of course they get a freaking golden opportunity in the fourth minute and i mean this obviously is going to be a goal for them and oh my god i can't believe i can't believe Bantre just freaking missed that how the hell do you miss that come on the counter attack for them i think it's good to we should be able to stop this hopefully 
and Zaratu. Zaratu should be on this. No, he's not. And okay, I think I, I think I'm legit just going to foul just for the sake of it right now because I have no idea what the hell is going on right now. Oh my days! Oh my days! Oh my fucking days! These guys are doing nothing. These guys are standing freaking still and doing nothing. It's irritating me. It's irritating my soul right now. We have a good attack here, and um, I think. Oh my days, he's actually free. Contega is actually free and definitely going to score this. And he actually he actually did not score that. He actually legit did not score that. That is unbelievable. Okay, they have a good opportunity for themselves here. I mean they pretty much scored almost all of their freaking attacks. And I'm not about to let this happen. I'm not about to let that happen for the third time. This team is so annoying to be honest. I should have made them my rivals to be honest, because can we just get the fucking ball please and it's really it's actually it's actually impossible to get the ball from these guys okay we have a solo run for german it should be fast enough to get past that defender and we should uh we should, we should be able to get the goal here i mean no cap we should be able to get the goal here if nothing goes wrong and of course everything went wrong and we we, we are literally unable to get a goal here in this match let's just wait for Fonseca to come back on side Please and we should score this. How how the hell was it? How, what the fuck? He came back on side. I really do not fucking need that right now. This match was complete shit. I'm really pissed off that all of that shit was happening. We have we, we were not able to do any fucking game this match. So annoying. And for some reason, Sevilla is the one team that we are unable to beat in this series. I mean, we have a match right off the bat next, and it's a golden opportunity for me to fuck them up. I'm going to be playing the full match, and I'm going all out yet, yet again. But I'm going to start with Madu K here, and I'll bring Brise on in. You know what? Let's leave. Let's leave. Um, what's his face? Kallenberg there to start the match, and I think I'm going to bring Lozano in to start as well. So, I mean, we should have plenty of time and plenty of opportunities for us to bring in better players in the second half so that we can fuck these guys up once and for all. I honestly can't believe that it's this hard to beat one team like Sevilla. I mean, they are nothing compared to our team. Good from Kallenberg. Let's see what else we can do right now. Please, who is there? Who is there? Who is there? No one is freaking there, but Stewart might be there and this is good but we're not able to capitalize on this at all. all right so i see a good opportunity here and if we're able to get Fonseca on this that would be absolutely brilliant and we do but we're not able to get the shot off what the hell why is everybody acting so bloody slow right now they have a free kick now and let's see if we can get the ball before anything else happens and we do and let's see if we can start a counter attack of some sorts and please tell me you're fast enough Tell me you are fast enough, German. You are supposed to be fast enough. For a curse and thank you. Oh my god. Why are you so bad at one on ones, to be honest? I mean, that's, that's like our first our first clear opportunity of this match, and we're just not able to do anything. You know what? I, I have to win this match, no matter what. Good, good interception there. And come on, German, you got this, you got this, you freaking got this, thank you. Power shot, please. No missing that, thank you. No way he's missing that. Good freaking opportunity and good cross from from Fonseca to be able to get get German there and that's that's a really good goal. Good match from us, good first half. We've done way better than them and we've had more opportunities and we've capitalized on just one of them. And let's see if we can do better in the second half. I'll be taking Lozano off and I'm taking Maduke off as well. Let's give that right wing a fresh a fresh feel and let's let's hope that we are able to get the better of the team with what we have right now and okay good start with Brise and please tell me you're off tell me you're off you are definitely off no one's there no one's there helping him and that was that was actually a really really good good run okay we do get the ball and we have a chance for Kallenberg to give it to German, who is in on goal. Please score it. And how, how, how do you not score that? Come on, what is wrong with this guy? I mean, the German has had an opportunity for a hat trick, and out of all of that, he's only been able to get one. Why is his finishing so freaking bad? Okay, so we have a good opportunity here. And please do not fuck this up. Do not freaking fuck this up, German. German, do not fuck this up. Come on. But no, I'm, 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 I'm just about done with this guy. 
just about done with him to be honest because I, I i don't understand why you are fucking up so much i'm going to bring bat in for james and i think that should be all i want to do for now i'm going to leave the defense as it is because that's the best defense we have right now and this one goal lead is not enough let's see if okay, it's just too high for him and Helvig, please and it was near post spots to keep out able to match that equally okay we have Somewhat of an opportunity and Fonseca should not miss this. Fonseca should not miss this. No way you're missing this. Thank you. 2-0. Good goal from Fonseca and that was a really lucky, lucky interceptor from Kallenberg and he wanted to find Fonseca and man there's no way you missing that. I'm pretty sure it was German. Man would have freaking lost that huge eagle but Fonseca is different. His thinking is really really good and there's no way that he was going to miss that. And we have a chance for Fonseca and oh that was that was cool but he's, he's pretty gassed and he's not able to run as fast as usual and the whole team is being so freaking sluggish right now can, can you guys like quit that shit two minutes is almost over and that's the end of the match we win it 2-0 and that's good that's a good i mean no match has annoyed me in the entirety of this series than this match right here because we deserve to win this match by fucking nail. We finally beat in Sevilla and I can finally let out the frustration I've been keeping in for so long with the fact that I have not been able to beat this team at all in this entire series. But we finally able to do this 2-0 because I've got things so much more, so much better. But I mean, it's FIFA, they fuck you up so many times. Right, the last match this episode is going to be against Real Madrid. That's the match we have right now. It's super Copa. And um, this is the one where all four, the top four teams from last season play, I think. I don't think Villarreal and Sevilla were the top four from last season. I really don't care. I'm not going to be playing the full match. I mean, if I knew, I wouldn't have played that full match against um, Sevilla. I thought that was just normal um, over the Espanya. But I'm going to be playing the full highlights of this. And our team is fucking fucked, to be honest. And, you know, I'm, I'm just going to leave the team as it is. I'm going to bring the players that I am able to bring and I'm going to put Ziyech in here and that's pretty much all I'm going to do for this match. Let's play the match and let's hope that we are able to get a win against Real Madrid here. Alright, so we are here in whatever stadium this is, I have no idea, but this is the Super Copa, it's the finals and this this might be the very first trophy that we lift in this series. Hopefully we are able to, that will be good for the morale of the team and I mean we're, we're, playing, we're going up against Real Madrid so it's going to be really tough for us to actually get the win but we have a free kick here so I'm just going to go as far as I can with this guy and nothing was able to come out of that but do we still have it? No we don't. Okay we have yet another opportunity and okay we have James on the ball right now and I'm looking at Okay, let's hope that we are able to get something out of this and we don't. Do we still have the ball? Yes, we do. That is good play. And who's there? Who's there? No one is there. And that was that was a really good opportunity that the, the, the game just did not let me let me have that to be honest. Because I tried my freaking best and the game just did not let me have that. We have a good at a good counter-attack here and let's try and give what the hell was that pass? Come on, what the actual fuck was that pass? My god, this game fucking hates me. This game hates me so much. Okay, I have an idea what we have to do right now, but I'm going to be able to get the ball easily here. Please, thank you. We are in the second half now, and there's a free kick for Real Madrid. And Cruz shouldn't be able to get this from here, could he? I mean, there's a possibility he can, but I'm just going to not take any risks. Please hold it, thank you, and we, we do end up getting the ball. And we have a solo run for from Tekka here, so please do not fuck this up. Do not fuck this up, okay? Who, who is backing me up right now? German is backing me up, but please do not go, go so wide. Give it back to Fonseca and please score it. Thank you. That's a really good goal. Really good well work to go for, for our team there. Fonseca to German, back to Fonseca, and he's not going to miss that in any way whatsoever. So, up next, we have a Real Madrid counter attack, and I mean, we've, we've been able to stop all their attacks so far and this should just be one one of it and how the hell did i miss see that coming but let's try and hold Vinicius here he's literally our main threat down the wing and come on just get the ball from him thank you and we literally give it back to him and we do win the match and we have won our very first trophy and it is real madrid at that it has been a really good match and i have no idea why they're not celebrating or anything really has going on 
for the actual fuck is going on right now. Alright, so we did win that match. I have no idea why we didn't get a cutting of us getting the trophy. And we see here that we do win the trophy, so that is our very first trophy that we are winning in this series, and that is really, really good for our team. But, anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Turn on the post notification so you'll be notified on when new videos drop of this series. I'll be uploading every day at 4 pm. And once again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.